Welcome back, everybody, to another cryptocurrency news article. This one comes out of Cointelegraph, and Bybit gets pre-approval in Kazakhstan as crypto custody service provider. The cryptocurrency exchange received a principal approval to operate in Kazakhstan at the Astana International Financial Center, so congrats, Bybit. But cryptocurrency exchange Bybit continues the expansion of its operations after receiving in-principle approval from regulators in Kazakhstan. On May 29th, the exchange announced its pre-approval from Kazakhstan's Astana Financial Service Authority, otherwise known as ASA, to operate as a digital asset trading facility and custody service provider at the Astana International Financial Center. Now, Ben Zhao, co-founder and CEO of Bybit, said he believes in the promising potential of the Commonwealth of Independent States, the CIS, as a region for growth in the crypto industry. Zell also stressed Bybit's commitment to compliance with local regulations. This comes after Bybit recently flagged by regulators in Japan for operating without registration. Now, it has always been our primary objective to operate in our business in compliance with relevant rules and regulations. And under the in-principle approval granted to Bybit, the company is subject to preconditions that will lead to permanent authorization to commence serving locals after the applications process is fully completed. Now, over the last few months, Bybit has been in the process of expanding its service offerings on May 2nd and announced it would begin offering users crypto lending services. In March, the company collaborated with MasterCard to offer a new debit card for cryptocurrency payments. And the latest move to offer services in Kazakhstan comes as the country has steadily developed itself as a regional hub for crypto mining and blockchain. In February, local officials announced a new mandate that 75% of revenue from crypto mining must be sold via a crypto exchange to crack down on tax evasion. A few months later, Kazakhstan revealed it collected around $7 million in crypto taxes in 2022. And Kazakhstan is currently in the pilot phase of development of a central bank digital currency. So again, countries all over the world are uh, getting their regulations in place, their CBDCs ready, and granting exchanges more approvals to just make sure people are, are in check to pay their taxes. <laughs> sure, there are ways around that, but other countries all around the world are getting prepared. U.S., come on, you guys are lacking. Like the biggest news we have in America is pro crypto. Uh, presidential candidates coming so who knows maybe that'll be a nice change of pace but that's still a whole another year away so again u.s is lacking while other countries are pushing forward some already have all their regulations in place set in stone and yeah they're they're doing well off <laughs> But yeah, so congrats by a bit on getting that pre-approval. Can't wait for the article for the full approval of your uh, services in Kazakhstan. So if you guys enjoyed this article, hit that thumbs up for me. Subscribe to the channel. And until next time, the Crypto Sherpa is out.